In Crystal Reports for Enterprise, you can use an SAP Business Explorer query as a data source. When connecting to a BAX query, Crystal Reports for Enterprise uses a Business Intelligence Consumer Services connection to communicate with SAP NetWeaver BW. In this tutorial, you will connect directly to a BAX query. Note that this tutorial covers features available in SAP Crystal Reports for Enterprise, version 14.0.0. Build our 760 v 2010 1019 To navigate, use the viewer controls or follow the on-screen instructions, if available. First, create a new blank report. Click File. Select New Report. You are prompted to enter your user credentials to connect to the central management server of the BI platform, to select a data source for the report. Click in the Password text box. Type password 1 and then click OK. You are prompted to select a data source. Select BAX as the data source type. Click the data source type list. Select SAP BAX query data access. Select the desired BAX query. Select FBT sales hierarchy query. Click Next. You can now create a query based on the data in the BAX query. BEX queries contain hierarchical objects, which organize data in a hierarchical structure. When you include a hierarchy as a result object, you can choose which levels and members of the hierarchy you want to use in your report. Expand the salesperson dimension to see the objects it contains. Click plus to expand salesperson. Notice that when you expand the salesperson dimension, at the top you can see two hierarchy objects. You also see a number of attribute objects, each of which provides descriptive data about the salesperson dimension. Add the first salesperson hierarchy to the query. Double-click salesperson. Open the member selector to view the contents of the hierarchy. Click member selector. Expand the hierarchy tree to explore its structure. Click plus to expand customer type. Click plus to expand enterprise. Click plus to expand large. Notice that the hierarchy groups the salespeople into categories, based on the types of customers they sell to. You can select the check boxes beside the members of the hierarchy that you want to use in your report. For example you could choose to report only on the results for large enterprise, and to show the individual results only for Nancy Davolio. However, if you want to create a report listing the results for all salespeople, and do not need to include the hierarchy structure in the report, you can create a query based on the salesperson dimension, rather than the salesperson hierarchy. Delete the salesperson hierarchy from the query, and replace it with the salesperson dimension. Click Cancel. Click the salesperson hierarchy. Click Delete. Add the salesperson dimension to the query. Double-click Salesperson. Add the city dimension and order amount measure to the query. Double click city. Double click order amount. Run the query. Click finish. The order amount for each salesperson is shown in the report, and none of the hierarchical information is included. You have successfully connected directly to a BAX query. This is the end of the tutorial.